What's up, ladies and gentlemen? Welcome back to Sam and Max, season one, episode one, Culture Shock. We are here in um, Sybil's psycho uh, analyst. Well, she's a psychotherapist, I guess. Uh, we just got psychoanalyzed and diagnosed with artificial personality disorder, which is a totally made up disorder. What is that sound? Is, is that the tiger clock? I think it's probably the tiger clock. <laughs> Oh man, I just love knocking Max out of the way. So point is, we have the APD form, which means we can finally get into Brady Culture's home for former child stars and try and sort out this criminal mastermind's devious plot to hypnotize all the child stars in the world. <laughs> um, which, to be fair, is a pretty strange plot. Wow, it's nighttime. I think I knew that earlier, but just like totally forgot. Okay, let's get in the car and um, see if we can get back to Brady Culture's Where home. Where are we going, Sam? Uh, <laughs> let's waste time driving around. No, we've done that so much already. All back right, to Brady let's go. Culture's home for former child stars. Oh, okay. Yeah, just chilled. Okay, whatever. Nothing weird about us going there. Okay, here we are. And I think we have to give the form to the monkey. I'm not sure. Will this let the us form in? only fits in the slot at Brady Culture's home. Oh, you have to do it in the form reader, duh. <laughs> Is this it? Okay. Hey, we have the heavily medicated what? I couldn't read the rest of that sign. That's so funny, like, you're only allowed in when you got a Come personality on, disorder. Heavily medicated has-beens, there we, we go. Can ice cream afterwards? Justice makes me hungry. You know, I, I get that. I like ice cream a lot, even in the middle of winter. I understand, uh, Max. Almost hit Sam. Oh, that looks really dodgy. With, like, all those beds just out there and everyone able to see each other. This reminds me of that place where Aunt Trudy lives with the medicine smell and the rubber sheets and the enormous mute Indian. Sounds what? like a million laughs. <laughs> what? Yeah, mostly after medication time. Where is everybody? <laughs> wow, Max. Oh, Brady Culture, he's here. Pulchritude above doubts. This is Culture's clubhouse. Jumping Lon Chaney in a Botho fright wig. Brady Culture, I presume. What the heck? You know who I am? <laughs> Wow, evil plans really do work. Don't get too excited, Stretch Pants. The freelance police are here. Yes, actually. I've been waiting for you. Oh, you have? Really? Okay. Next time, try leaving the front door open. Save us all some grief. Allow me to explain. <coughs> Uh-oh, I think we just triggered a solo. Oh, goodness. Good thing I have the attention span of a pint of yak butter. <laughs> I never wanted much. Just to be universally loved, that's all. And to be number one in the TV ratings for the 1971 fall season. But no, those worthless hacks, the soda puppies, with their matching shirts and their cute little jingles, they came on opposite me and stole my audience. I was never offered another role. Sounds like someone's really YouTube bitter. Vigilantes won't even let a poor, down on his luck actor mass hypnotize the entire viewing public to become his worshipful fans forever. How cruel. Oh, woe is me. Is it over? I think <laughs> so. So. I love Max. Oops. Since you've ruined the beautiful irony yep, of how my arch rivals run my promotional campaign. I'm afraid you'll just have to take their places. Oh, goodness, in your no. Dreams, culture. No, my friends. In yours. Oh, no. Hey, that tickles. Become video delivery man. What? Video delivery man? That ain't good. Oh, no. He's, he's got us on what? his control. What's happening? Oh, no. Oh, no. What are you doing? I don't know. I... You were in on it all along. I told you it was a conspiracy. I told you, but then you already knew, didn't you? No, Bosco. I must deliver videos. Call the CIA. Call Interpol. Call Mickey Rooney. <laughs> must what? deliver Mickey Rooney videos. 
Oh man, poor Bosco. No, what do we do? No. I must deliver videos. How do we stop this? How do we stop I must this? Deliver videos. Can we grab something that hey, will? My beloved weapons are gone. Oh no. Okay. Can we grab something on the way out to get in trouble? Grab the oh, cheese. Grab the cheese. Try. Yes. Okay, that'll work. Whew. That I wasn't too body. difficult. Okay, but someone's got to dehypnotize us. Max, where are you? What happened? Oh. What? Uh -oh. Either I just walked into the Salvador Dali Memorial Wax Museum, or I'm dreaming. Oh my goodness, you this is so me. weird. You adore me. Become video delivery man. <laughs> what? Do my evil bidding. The fish outside the forth. window? <laughs> Holy brains in a blender. I'm still hypnotized. If only I could remember what Sybil told me to do. Destroy the intruder in your dream. Oh, yeah. Hey, Sam, I'm up here. Oh, hi, little buddy. Brady stole my body. I hate when people do that. <laughs> I hate it. From here. Okay, little guy, I'll save you. You know, it's happened to me a few times. I get you, buddy. Really sucks when people do that. Okay, but like, um... So this is all in our mind, but like, what can we actually do? I will be number one in the ratings. Now, and thanks to Cable... For all eternity. Well, dude, you're gonna have to compete with like Netflix and Disney Plus and all of that. Really good luck. <laughs> stole Max's body. Oh, and it feels good too. I just love my new furry paws and cute little tail. Hey, don't touch my tail, you psychopathic <laughs> body stealer! Ooh, just let me at him. Oh, how do you do this? How do you do this? Okay, um, can we? Oh, we only got a gun. Okay. Uh, what's this one-way sign? What is sign? this doing here? Hey, it's loose. Oh, does that change the gravity? Whoa. Ooh. That was the most fun I've had since I lost my body. Let's do it again, Sam. Hmm, what now? Yeah. Oh, okay, so we gotta catch him great. somehow. But Sam, if you'll notice, I'm right back where I started. Okay, yeah. hold on, I'll think of something. Yeah, okay, we gonna have to think of something, cause... It's just a dream, Sam. Oh, yeah, but that doesn't help us. It's Brady culture in a light socket? Oh. What the if we switch off the light? Represents wisdom, and here's a little now. Brady culture is a perfect ten. Uh, well, he'll be a perfect zero I when he switches you off. <laughs> turn the lights out on your career, Brady. What? Uh, no! Bye. -bye. <laughs> oh, that Brady culture. He turns the world off with his smile. Indeed. Okay, so, and we got to get rid of the TV. On TV. Yes, right where I belong. Everyone watch me. Me. <laughs> we'll just switch off the TV, right? That seems like the logical thing to do. Or take a take out the, the Yeah. Picture quality if I gave this a tug. No. I must be on TV for all eternity. No. Oh yes, that's much better reception. <laughs> it was much better received, for sure. <laughs> Got a bunch of smoke there. Why is the smoke doing there? Weird. Yeah. Okay, and we got <laughs> Jimmy Two Teeth just Strange. chilling here. We got Jesse James's hand. And inside the door. Oh. I will be universally loved by everyone in the universe. Ready culture's a bunch of cheese now. I really want to say that's cheesy, what but that's really thing? kind of cheesy. <laughs> Oh, hello. Sweet rodent eating disorders. That is one fat Well, I rat. think he, he can eat. No, I wanted him to eat Brady culture. How do we, how do we get that to happen permanently? Like, I want him to stay big. Or do we open the door and then do it? Brady culture. Let's do it. Hey, Brady cheese. What is it, fool? I'd like to introduce you to a little friend of mine. Say hello to my little friend. No, the cheese must stand alone. <laughs> <laughs> well, he's a goner. And another one bites the cheese. Okay, we just got one problem now, which is Max. How 
Uh, or you know what? What if we stand underneath him and shoot the sign? Then we can grab it. want to name every single one of your children after me? Hell no! <laughs> Grab him, Whoa. grab him! Gotcha. Yes, Yay! there we go. <laughs> Perfect. Brilliant. Now we got a max head in our inventory. <laughs> hey, little buddy. Oh, Mr. Culture, I have a surprise for you. Really? For me? Just for you, dude. No! <laughs> oh, my. Yum, yum, yum. Oh my goodness, dude. Wear a mask. Thanks, Sam. <laughs> a little stringy, but good. Oh, I just remembered. I'm supposed to be somewhere. Bye, Max. That's it, I guess. Oh, uh. Oh no! He's awake! We're done for! Save the girlish histrionics, Bosco. I'm all right. Hmm. For now. I'm nearly the victim of your garden variety video delivery hypnosis scheme. Okay, garden variety. but what about your co-conspirator? My co-conspirator? Ooh. Holy underpants draped to the mast of a sinking pork rind freighter. That hirsute egomaniac kidnapped my little buddy. Oh, goodness, of course. Yeah, we haven't seen Max. Any idea how I can curtail this culture crisis? Brady culture. Ibo man. <laughs> Stay away from him. He's got it in for me. Sorry, Bosco. No can do. I've got to save my furry little pal. Yeah, uh, we can't just let this go. I don't suppose you have a Bosco Tech device that stymies hypnosis-inducing energy beams. Oh, a, a hypnosis blocker? Yeah, I thought about making one of those, but I wouldn't even know where to begin. So we gotta figure out how to block the hypnosis something. somehow. Well, that doesn't help. Thanks, Bosco. Do me proud. Do we have, like, a tinfoil hat anywhere or something? Seriously, hey, you got nothing else more to you offer, will... dude? Yep. Skip, skip, skip. Yeah, wow. Thanks, Bosco. Do me proud. He ain't no good to us. Okay, there's got to be something. Um, <laughs> we can't exactly stick our head in a microwave. There's no time for that. I've got to rescue Max. Yeah, yeah, sure, dude. But how are you going to protect yourself against hypnosis? That won't help me rescue Max. Okay, look, I'm I'm just trying things here. If you, if you help me, maybe we can figure this out. <laughs> okay, um... Perhaps we need to... Oh, let's just triple check. The, sli the, the sleaze. The cheese is not going to be helpful. Is there anything in the garbage can? You know who would have loved that? Max. Aw, dude. You're missing him already. All right, let's... Let's have a look around town. There has to be something. Stinky's Diner? I don't think we can get in there. Nothing in the newspaper box. Um, let's go have a look inside the office. Because we don't want to go away to Brady and just end up, like, doing all of this again. Um, we do anything with the Max coat hanger? Max isn't going to like it when he finds out I ruined our reception. I've got to tell him as soon as possible. Okay, so we have that as an inventory item. Can we combine that with anything? It just looks like all the same stuff here. There's nothing more That's in the answering exactly machine, right? exactly the sort of thing Max would have looked at. Oh man, dude, you're making me miss Max so much. Is there anything in his that desk, makes perhaps? makes me miss Max for some unknown reason. <laughs> you're just gonna say that for everything. What if we chat to Jimmy Two Teeth? Can he Max, help us? is that you? No, I'm starting to hallucinate. <sighs> wow, it's that bad. <laughs> Max, are you in there? Hallucinations just getting you, buddy. Uh, okay, so there's nothing in the closet. Uh, we can't do anything just no James' hand. That. I've got to rescue Max. Well, then, in that case, what can we even do here? If we could find a tinfoil hat, then... You know, maybe that could work. Could we use this to, like, change the reception on There's our no hat or something? That. I've got to rescue no. Max. Okay, we gotta find something. Um... What if we chat to Sybil? Maybe she'll know how to prevent hypnosis. Howdy, Sybil. Doc. Doc! Max is gone. Well, most of us outgrow our imaginary friends eventually. No, <laughs> what? that megalomaniac Brady Culture's got him. He's not imaginary. I see. Of course. Well, you're not going to be any help, are you? Hang on. Were you implying <clears throat> that Max is imaginary? I wasn't implying anything, though he does seem a little improbable. You see him too, though, right? 
True, but then I'm a psychotherapist. <laughs> wow. Psychotherapists have got like invisibility, invisibility vision or whatever. I've got to find some way to block a hypnotic ray. I don't suppose oh, you she's a brain, a brain specialist, specialist I guess. of sorts would know anything. Uh, <laughs> Great suffering lab rats, you do know something. What? I'll okay. It before my synapses fuse into a milky puddle of slag. Well, it's a gross breach of doctor patient privilege for me to even tell you about it. But one of my more technologically inclined patients drew me a diagram Ooh. of a contraption he claimed will block hypnosis. Well, this might just help That's us. That's just the sort of ridiculously lucky break I need. It's a huge violation of every reasonable code of ethical conduct, of course. But you being a policeman of sorts, I suppose it's okay to give you the diagram. Ah. Hmm. My lack of solid engineering background has finally caught up with me. I can't make any sense of it. I this. see a coat hanger. I'd love to help, but engineering is one of the few fields I haven't tried. Sorry. Well, next episode, right? <laughs> okay, let's have a look at this. That won't help me decipher this diagram. You know, maybe Bosco could decipher it. Um, see, seeing as he's like a conspiracy nut and everything. He might be able to give us... Because I also saw... Is it called a sieve? That metal thing with the holes in it? <laughs> Gosh, I feel so uneducated asking that question. Um, but maybe he's got one of those in his inconvenience store or something. All right, let's let's show him the diagram. Bosco, take a gander at this. What is it? A death threat? Even no. Better. It's instructions for the latest in Bosco tech innovation. Yeah. Hmm. Uh, let's see. A colander for that. A colander, yeah. right. Oh, yeah. I can build this. Just need one thing. What's that? Something for that antenna thing at the oh, top. Oh, we got that. Antenna. Got it. Wow, look at us being so prepared without even trying. <laughs> Will a make-do antenna do as a make-do antenna? Yeah, mm. okay. Yeah. Let me just add a little Bosco tech innovation. And here it is. The most sophisticated hypnosis blocking <laughs> helmet the world has ever seen. Happy days are here again. Uh oh, it seems like the old moolah gauge is running on empty. Ah, take it. Just stop that Brady culture. He's got it in for me. You're a credit to dementia, Bosco. <laughs> to dementia. Pay for the next one, though. Okay, shall we just put this on? Uh, I'll put it on inside Brady Culture's home. <laughs> I wouldn't want to be caught wearing last year's fashions in this neighborhood. Oh, wow. <laughs> last year's fashions. Okay, if you say so. Okay, let's head to Brady Culture's home and let's actually take down this guy. Um, he's been causing too much chaos and I, I cannot forgive him for what he did to us. I'm coming, Max. And the fact that he stole Max as well. Like, he stole a person. Okay. Let's put the hat on. Uh, I'll put it on inside. Oh, really, dude? Okay, I mean... That might be too late. You don't know, maybe he's hiding behind Rule the door or something. Three. Always wear protective headgear when confronting diabolical villains with hypnotic devices. Oh, now you're doing it, okay. <laughs> Let's go for it. Warning, vehicles will be stolen, what? <laughs> Hand over the Lagomorph, culture. See? The Lagomorph? Boy, am I glad to see you. Johann Sebastian here only knows how to play one song. <laughs> What's this, a rerun? Didn't we just see the dog getting hypnotized episode? <laughs> oh, well, he looks so funny really with that. Watch it again. Ooh. What? Another triumph for <laughs> skanky ingenuity and ordinary kitchenware. Give it up, culture. Your quiche is cooked. <laughs> the cavalry. Are they you here? Outside the lines of the law, Brady culture. We see you, and this time we're going to get hypnotized again. Oh man, I was thinking this is so cool. We got like a whole I'm Avengers sure team here. Remember the commands I taught you. So now, my foolish pawns, attack the dog. Ouch. Oh. Okay. How do we? Okay, so they just like attacking there. Well, give up now, culture. Your hypnotic ray thing and won't work on me anymore. True, but I have my adoring minions. Yeah, they don't really like me. <laughs> Shut up. They do so. I forced them to. <laughs> wow, okay. So it's a stack of those Ibo videos. And a Every television's bed's got its own TV. Creepy. Yeah, that is pretty creepy. Um I feel like making a bad pun about Brady's organ, but I'm a little busy right now. Wow, okay. That's like a bit unnecessary. You okay, buddy? 
Oh, sure. I've been amusing our adversary with gory haiku poems while he plays that dumb song over and over. Hey, that's my theme song. <laughs> How is he just floating in the air there? Um, okay, let's think about this. Maybe we can tell them what to do. Attack Brady Culture. Attack Brady Culture. No, attack the dog. Ow. Oh, okay, that's not going to work. Uh, who else can we attack? Yourselves. Attack yourselves. Oh, they're already doing the that. <laughs> Ouch. Okay, um, are they, what are the other attack options? Me, the videotapes, and never mind. I wonder how you feel about attacking the videotapes. Attack the videotapes. Buffoons. Attack the dog. Okay, so the, I guess the attack option is probably not going to work. Let's see what Become does. Become Brady Culture. Become Brady Culture. <laughs> Do my evil bidding. Worship the video oh, wow. What nonsense. Attack the dog. Okay, um... Okay, this is gonna be interesting. Attack me. Whoops. <laughs> I, I'm trying to figure out what's the right combination we could do here. Oh, we can tell him to worship. Okay, okay. Worship me. And then maybe he'll ask them to, to worship him. Worship me. Yeah, oh, okay. Me, me, worship me. You're my minions, mine. Okay, and then what do we do? It's a stack of those. I... Now we tell them to become Brady Culture? Become Brady Culture. <laughs> Do my evil bidding. Worship the videotapes. What nonsense. Okay, so, so we got to get the right combination here. Um, definitely worship gets us somewhere. Worship me. What if we keep no, telling it like me, bouncing me. backwards and forwards? Worship me. Everything is about me. Okay, we do it again. Worship me. No, me, me. Worship oh no, great. Me. He's just going to repeat the same thing. So, there's got to be another step here. Have we got anything in our inventory? Can we Attack hit him now? No, okay. <laughs> um, okay. Worship me. No, me. Let's see what. Um. Attack Brady. Now culture. they're standing on top no. of him. Maybe they can attack, attack him. The dog. No. Okay. Yeah. So we gotta get this combination is gonna be um quite interesting. Okay, let's just remind ourselves. We can tell them to become Brady Culture, me themselves, or the videotapes. Or we can tell them to worship those four. Or we can tell them to attack those four. And if we tell, tell them to do any of these four, then there's a problem. If we if we tell them to become any of those four, then it's still a problem. Become yourselves. I don't think we tried that attack one. The dog. Ow. Okay. So, definitely worshipping Worship me. me gets us somewhere. No. What happens if we try and free Max? Nice hat, by the way. It protects me from that ray of his. Speaking of which, I don't see you delivering videotapes. Yeah, apparently I can't be hypnotized. <laughs> it was driving the Phantom here, Berserk. There's got to be something wrong with his brain. Well, that goes without saying. Do we tell him to worship Max? Worship Brady culture. <laughs> okay, so he's happy about that. Worship the videotapes? Worship the videotapes. Imbeciles. Attack okay, no, that dog. didn't work. Ouch. There has to be something I'm missing. Surrender. I've got the place surrounded. I want liar pants on fire. Um, and if we try and hit them, rush! they just dodge. 
Okay, what if we attack them after worship me. telling them to worship him? No, me, me, worship me. Everything is about me. And if we attack them now? Caffeine Oh, they just dodge it. Okay, um... Let's worship, worship me some me. more. No, Skip to me. tip. And let's see what happens if we tell them to become me. Become me. No, me. me. Oh, okay, there become we go. Me. So we're getting him caught in a loop. <laughs> what? Hey, wait a second. Attack the dog. <laughs> okay, so we got it. The next one we got to do um, would be worship attack me. me, and then maybe they'll attack him because no, he'll be like me, me, me. me. Worship. Okay, skip, skip, skip. Hopefully this is it. Wow, I hope I figured this out now, guys. Attack me. No, me. Attack me. Ha. Me, me, wow. me. Yes. Oops. No, wait. I mean. Too late. Oh. Oh. Smart hey. move, Sam. You played him oh. like a two-dollar glockenspiel. I learned all my best tactics in the first grade. <laughs> I tried to send you semaphore signals with my ears, but you know how I always get the K and the V mixed up. What's semaphore? Like the plane up, thing? Buddy. Where you like tell the planes to land? Well, I guess we should dehypnotize these poor saps again and be on our way. Let me! You know how I adore gratuitous violence. Yep. <laughs> Ouch. Oh, we got the glasses. Oh, okay. I was about well, to say, let's not that, keep Max. them. Another boot to the pasty ass of crime. Thank goodness this whole hypnotic mind control thing didn't go any further. That could have been really annoying. Oh no, don't tell me someone else is using the technology. It's great to be on your show, Myra. I'm a huge fan. I just can't seem to stop watching for some reason. Oh no, man. <laughs> wow. <laughs> the credits music is crazy. Wow, so that that was super cool, guys. I actually really like Sam and Max. It's just such a a fun and entertaining game and like the humor is really awesome and the puzzles you know aren't too bad some sometimes adventure games can be really like devious with how difficult the puzzles are but i really enjoyed these puzzles um and it was an interesting story like um it's clearly there's more coming down the line because they obviously teased episode two and maybe maybe the whole season is gonna have something to do with hypnosis um especially because all of the artwork has like the spiral thing in the background so you know i've been doing that for like my channel as well for like all the thumbnails so I'm imagining the whole thing is about hypnosis. Um, but who, Myra, they said her name was? So she's a TV host and she's um, hypno hypnotizing people into watching her show and liking it. Um, so I guess we're probably gonna have to take her down next episode. I think that was the demo I played where we had to audition for a TV show or something. Something like that, that's all I can remember. So that, if, if this is a TV, um, Post in the next episode then it would make sense that that would be what appears there so um yeah i'm really excited for what's coming and i'm curious what they're gonna do with this i i think from what i've heard that the last part of the season is like it gets better as the season goes on so if this is wow okay if this is how it's starting then point is i'm super amped and i'm loving it hope you guys are loving it too and you know if you guys uh, enjoyed this video don't forget to give me a like it really helps me out it helps me know what content you guys enjoy the most so that i know what to aim for on my channel and it also you know helps me feel good about what i'm doing so don't forget to do that and if you enjoy the these videos and you want to see what else is on my channel feel free to have a look there subscribe and i'll see you guys next time on sam and max with episode two what is episode two called it's called situation comedy yes Okay, I will see you guys next time on episode two of Sam and Max. Bye for now.